everyone, Helen McConnell here from PurposeProsperityHappiness.com and welcome to this series of videos on emotional spring cleaning. And you can use this any time of year, it doesn't have to be spring, but for some reason when we're in this sort of renewal phase of life, we tend to be more open, we're kind of waking up to some new things. But emotional clearing and cleaning can happen at any time of the year. This is a great time, however, to, to get started with this process. So the first thing that I'm inspired to talk to you about is anger, hurt, and grudges. If we're holding on to old hurt, anger, or grudges, it is like a heavy weight. It's like a cluttery mess. And we spend a lot of time avoiding looking at them, at those hurts, or talking to those people. We might avoid talking to those people. There's a lot of energy wasted in that. And so I invite you to take a look at this moment, just sense inward, is there someone or something that you're really holding a grudge against, a hurt about, anger at? And let's do a little tapping, okay? Just identify the person, place, institution that you're, you're angry at. Notice where you feel it in your body and rate the intensity of that feeling from zero to 10, zero being not at all, 10 being totally intense. And just tap along with me. You can reuse this tap along as many times as you need to begin to bring that number down. As you tap, just notice what might be hiding behind this hurt, anger, or grudge. There's probably something behind it, but just tap with me. We're gonna go kind of general. Even though I'm holding this anger at them, and them can be anything, I deeply and completely love and accept myself right where I am. Okay. And then just tap around the points and say this anger, I'm holding this anger toward them. I'm protecting myself by staying angry. But I'm hurting myself by staying angry. This anger, I feel it in my body. So it must be affecting me. This anger, I've been holding this anger for a long time. And part of me doesn't want to let it go. But I wonder if it's possible that I can make a decision to let it go. That instead of being angry at this person, I can mentally surround them with love. And I can let go of this anger in my body and be free. Take a nice deep breath. Notice if anything shifted or changed in your body or the intensity of that anger, hurt, or grudge. And, and rate the new number. Might have gone up, might have gone down. But use this over and over. Keep tapping until that one thing seems to have dissipated where you're either not feeling it, and I don't mean stuffing it, but where it's truly gone, where you can begin to see that person or that institution surrounded by love so that you can let it go from your own body and you're beginning your emotional spring cleaning. Stay tuned for all the videos in this series. Namaste.